Wilson with the E-Team looking at ATM smash and grabs. Check this out. I've mapped out more than 60 of these crimes that have happened since last summer. Nearly a dozen of them coming after Cleveland City Council proposed a law to protect store owners from this happening. But that was in late December. It's now three months later and there's still no law. Their proposal centers around these bollards or barriers right in front of the store. Cities facing similar issues with ATM thefts have made the ballers mandatory in front of stores. Experts tell me just installing these cuts down on smash and grabs almost completely. So in December, Councilman Anthony Brancatelli proposed legislation requiring stores to install the bollards and take other measures to stop the crimes. But there's been no movement since. He told me since the city is waiting for the state to pass legislation first before they make a move. But when I reached out to uh, the state about this issue, I was told uh, uh, Ohio Representative Tom Patton told me that he's encouraging the city to move forward with their law as the two are different. Live in the newsroom, Lauren Wilson, News 5's E-Team.